Hey baby, so check got us through three. How's your girl, guys? So thank you for being here, like, subscribe, and share. Happy Taco Tuesday to Kid Tuesday, and I'm saying whatever your vice is. So energy, energy for resume. That song, Beauty, is her name. I guys, that song was in my head so much yesterday. I'm like spirit. Can we just go over this? one more time okay so then all night all this morning it's like oh that's so crazy that's why sometimes i feel like when i post on my instagram or some of my stories when somebody watches my instagram story over and over again it's like i hear it in my head i can't explain it but it's like i just i be knowing so you guys crew so energy energy for resume so and then after that i got the feeling that you might be so i feel like that there's somebody that's super duper attracted to you. I'm picking up two different energies. I'm picking up the energy that somebody that's super duper attracted to you and you know. Then you have somebody that's super duper attracted to you and you don't know. And they're planning on planning on making a move. And then you have a divine feminine masculine energy. Because you know what I'm saying? It, it's always three. Okay? It's always three. Because in the Bible there were three well-known angels. And one of them got booted out. You know what I'm saying? Got we know who that is. You know what I'm saying? So it's always a power of three. You know, say all these things come in threes because that is a pure power of divinity. That is a pure, the, the power of spirituality. So tongue tied this morning, guys. I started my video over like 10 times. My daughter was cracking up. She's like, mom, I hear you in there. Hey, such a guy. So, so with these three energies, uh, beauty is her name. I got a feeling that you might be. And then I feel like that there are for a small percentage that there is a divine feminine masculine that before they make a final move to be with you in, the, in your situation and your connection that they're going to test you okay so number one stay in integrity at all times because be who you are behind people's backs as well as you are in their, their face okay this is driving me nuts be who you are behind their back as well in their face also um if you want to be a wife, you should act like a wife already or a husband. You should be acting like that. So when the time comes, you're ready. You know what I'm saying? That's the part where they say, say, raise it, don't got to get ready. Because how what you want to do and how you want to be in life is achieving it, is believing that you already have it. Okay, so such a guy's crew. Energy to energy, if it res it. I, I just, I like, I don't even know where to start first. So we'll just pull some cards and see true love. I hope and I can make you my. I feel like somebody's worried. That you may be with somebody else. It's your twin flame soulmate, baby. That's who it is. The hope that they can make you <laughs> for somebody else steals your heart. True love. You're in your twin flame soulmate connection. It is mutual. Okay. However you may feel for your person, it is mutual. I just, I have a hard time believing that someone could have a really, really super strong feeling for somebody and they don't, re they don't feel the same. I know it's possible. Okay. But we're being positive being positive i'm talking about a positive nature i just feel like if you and it's so funny because i t I, I say this a lot and then so when when somebody i know reiterated it back to me and gave me confirmation you know what i'm saying, so, you know what I'm saying? when it comes to spirituality it's like that it's not just a me 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 it's not just me being the terror it's not just me bringing your energy it's me reading your energy you getting the confirmation and also me getting confirmation it's it's a one hand washes the other you know what i'm saying me you and god the core three divinity baby so this is your true love. This is your twin flame, okay? This is somebody that mutually loves you, that mutually respects you, and they love your loyalty, okay? So, can we clarify hurtful words? I feel like somebody's in regret. I'm hoping I can make you mine. Yeah, whatever they said in the past, that was very, very minute proposal. And guys, I've been picking up a lot of this proposal energy as well. Like, and I'm saying, I, you guys know, if you read, if you're listening to other tarot readers, a lot of people are picking up proposal energy as well. Okay, so, so this person, hurtful words planning ahead, rewrite love story. And because hurtful words came out that your person has like, wants to acknowledge that at some point they may have said hurtful word for you also they're planning on if they, if you that pregnancy energy you know it comes with the marriage you know what i'm saying opportunities to reconcile love okay so rewrite your love story true love twin flame so whatever must have separated you guys or 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 came in between you guys what it was or is or can be and may will be it's hurtful words okay so this person they're totally taking accountability for that this person i'm telling you they want to get married to i just feel like something with the moon and and yesterday when i got my new cards the moonlight card i feel like this person i feel like you and your person may have had sex because remember sex is a sacred act right i feel like something about having sex under the moon with you and your person that that did something for this connection love shack 
something love shack baby okay spirit can you clarify i don't know if i want to use these first i think i want to use some traditional clear Clara. Some traditional Clara. So clear audience, clairvoyance. I feel like you and your person definitely lots of telepathic communication. Clear audio. I feel like you're a divine masculine feminine energy. I feel like they're ascending as well. Okay. Spirit, can you clarify hurtful words? Yeah. Whatever they said, hoping I could make you mine. Whatever they said in the past to you that hurt you, they regret it. It's like they sometimes this person is energy I'm picking up is that they may go back and reread the text messages of the things you said. Okay. They they may have did that, but they 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 regret that because whatever they said to you to you at the energy I'm picking up is they were running from something and you were there the whole time and whatever they're running from, it was like they put that on you. It's like, you know what I'm saying? You were the one that was trying to be for this person. That's the past. I just feel like this energy is taking accountability for the things that happened in the past. Just because someone's saying, listen, I want to acknowledge the fact that in the past I did hurt you and I've said hurtful words and you were, you're my true love. You're my twin flame soulmate. That's not something that I should have had happen. So a very sincere apology from this person, a very sincere apology from this energy that those hurtful words... It, what hurt what i'm getting is very saying like though hurting you hurt me okay this person saying hurting you hurt me and they don't want to do that ever ever again ever again and i love see what i love about tarot and stuff is like some of these energies and everyone's not a bad person everyone's you know what i'm saying energy is very fluid in the world just as when you can walk by a happy person, sad person, groovy person, crying person, confused person, crazy person, that's the same energy that the world and the world that's out, okay? And also has a lot to do with the people and the energies that you're around. But the energy, see how this, this energy saying, I'm still in love with you, you're my true flame, but also an energy of... I know what I did wrong. I would like to take accountability, 6.55 on the clock, because I was making those changes, okay? Because this person, um, you know, we I, I just feel like also tarot's like a little giveaway because there is a proposal plan for someone, okay? And your person saying, listen, before I propose for you, before you know. It's so funny because I watched a show yesterday where you call your friend's boyfriend or whatever, like that prank show, and the, the girlfriend said to the other friend, I'm planning a proposal. So I think it's cool that this came out. So your person... Before they can make it right, they want to right their wrong. So we're saying before they can make it right, they want to right their wrong. Central guys crew, energy, energy. If it resonates, it resonates. Okay, so let's see what we got here. Yeah, before they right their wrongs, they want to make it right. I love how spirit. Before they right their wrongs, they want to make it right. All this conflict, whatever conflicting energy that you and your person were ever in, they they want to soothe that over. True love, you are their true love. You are like the beautiful top-notch noble successful stable person and what they love about this is connection is you okay this connection may start off as a sexual connection okay and because i got the wands and when i pick up wands i know it's sexual energy okay because of the fact that your person maybe at some point you were oh like all right we have a sexual connection you know what i'm saying and you were okay with that and your person was shocked Okay, because they weren't used to that. And you were saying like, at this point in time, however our connection could, will be, I'm accepting that. But it's like, it was mutual. Anything that you guys did was mutual. Okay, it never was, you know, everyone has their arguments and back and forth. But it's like, you guys, somebody set a boundary and the other person was like, okay, and respected it. And that's, that's basically um what i've never been married so i can't i've been in super long-term relationships but that's basically the foundation of this person saying like you guys coming to common grounds okay you guys come to common grounds with this connection and you you may have put up strict boundaries with this person because the queen of swords but come you compared to a lot of other people in their life they've never got that mutual love from someone that mutual love that mutual respect it's a lot about the mutual loyalty spirit tell me it's a lot about the mutual loyalty like they've never got that your strict boundaries within the relationship and the connection you don't let this person run all over you they like that they're used to that okay they're used to people that they can just do whatever say whatever however but your mutual respect for yourself and your person they like that the boundaries you have for yourself and your person they like that the boundaries they have for this relationship this connection for not only you and their self and the privacy of this connection they like that 
what this person saying like why are you someone that i would not want to get married to you embody everything that i have i need to take accountability for what i did in the past but i also know that how you are your boundaries within yourself this connection and us and me and you is something that's mutual and i love that and they this person has an up utmost respect for you twin flames utmost respect they really respect you as a person so what do they want to do they want they want this beginning they want this wonderful life with you you know what i'm saying spirit can you clarify love and relationship planning ahead i feel like this person okay so with the two wands very passionate i feel like this person may be wanting to plan ahead something but also this person saying they want to plan ahead because the when we get a tower card everyone ah, freaks out no this person saying i want to come in and i want to plan ahead so if you're a planner and your person knows that they're respecting that okay and they're saying listen i want to manifest this future that we have I want to plan ahead because I don't want us to run into any type of problems or anything because I want this on top of Twin Flames rewrite this love story. It's a new beginning for you guys. It's a new beginning. You know what I'm saying? Energy change and shifts so fast. Rick, can you clarify? Rewrite your love story. 10 44 o'clock with hopes of a bright, amazing, wonderful, loving future with you. Also, opportunities and reconcile love ready for this connection also this person if you guys don't have kids they have kids if you can't have kids they want to share something a common item for you guys to bond over and i'm picking up like a dog a pet okay maybe a pool even okay so spirit can you clarify proposal for me please spirit can you clarify proposal for me because this person they're working really really hard on themselves you i saw the sign see how your your heart is open and it's illuminating this person's here he's looking at her like dad i could you know what I'm saying? I, you, you are some hope and I can make you my look proposal energy. Okay. So this person they're saying, like, I'm working on myself over time. Temperance is working on herself worth the wait. And 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 in essence, spirit's telling me say in essence, okay? Because what a proposal comes to a marriage okay so such a guys crew energy is energy if it resonates res it's really really looking for it. I'm telling you guys something with you guys in the moon. Did I bring my Moonology cards? No, I'm going to grab my Moonology cards. But something with you guys in the moon. Talk. Maybe you need, maybe that talking to the moon sign. Maybe something happened with the moon. I don't want you guys to see my business. Maybe something with the moon. Though. You know what I'm saying? Something. Let's clarify some of these things with the moon. Hope you guys have a great Taco Tuesday, baby. Going to do some. A new romantic cycle begins. I'm going to do some reading and some laundry. And you know what I'm saying? Okay, so Spirit, can you clarify hurtful words? Show the world the real use and work through your fears. I feel like this person, they kind of pushed you away in the past because they were in love with you and they did not express it. We're not going to go no more. Spirit tend to not dwell on the past, but just be be just that spirit and and our ancestors and god's very happy and encouraged that this person actually acknowledged it so they're taking accountability that don't you want that in a husband <laughs> or a wife you know what i'm saying taking accountability don't let your past hold you back okay um you and your loved ones are safe so true love this is literally a true love mutual love mutual respect mutual loyalty you're safe with it okay so spirit can you clarify twin flames a new beginning please the end of a tough cycle approaches because your person has came to a final conclusion decision that you are someone who they want to spend their life with they're no longer going back and forth they're in their mind wrestling about if they want to be with you okay so the uh, capricorn energy okay you know capricorns capricorns are tough they're hard working if your divine masculine feminine has capricorn and any of their moon rising sun signs they are very hard workers they like to plan ahead okay if you don't think so i'm telling you okay they that look at planning ahead on a on a plan ahead card for 12 and soulmate that's what they want to do they're planning ahead for this connection Spirit, can you clarify planning ahead a win-win outcome is in forecast and bring love into the situation. A win-win outcome is forecast, bring love situation because they're planning. The balance is, the scales are tipping. They know what they want. Okay, they know what they want and they're going to show you the real you. They're going to show you how you're not going to, this person is so damn loving and affectionate. You, you wouldn't think that. You, you just, how this person is going to come in and how they're going to show you their true self. You're going to be shocked. You thought you were in love with them before. You're going to be, this is your husband. You're going to be, and wife, you're going to be shocked how much love this person has for you, how much love they embody, how much love they've been holding back from you. Okay, Spirit, can you clarify rewriting love story? I told you. 
with the star card, baby. Opportunities to reconciliate 1430 on the clock because they love you. Expect this card's so powerful. I get goosebumps when you see it. If you get goosebumps or um like goosebumps or what's the other one? What is another name they call it? That's confirmation from your spirit. Nobody can make that up. You know what I'm saying? So if you get goosebumps, that's conf confirmation, okay? Energy is energy. If it resonates, it resonates. Okay, so spirit, let's clarify some of these. And then we'll end off with our universal love card. Which I don't know why I always want to think like soul train with that. I always want to take soul train. Spirit, can you give me some cards to clarify the overall energy of how this person feels about this connection? Okay. Insight. See? caring i told you they're gonna come up with some love you but you love, you love like that damn inside okay inside this is these are just some words about how your person feels about the connection they've gathered some insight okay transformation grounded because this person the energy at first you know what i'm saying they weren't sure they weren't it's like they weren't grounded okay yeah i had a connection but it's like the socket socket spirits will be like sex too like once you socked it would you put it together they felt grounded within your connection okay godliness because they know this is a twin flame soulmate connection your godliness you being in your image of god like not only help this person realize that there's true love but also help this person believe in the love of god such a god is true and awareness believe in the love of god okay the gentleness is a path of peace your gentleness your person and bodies is 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 what helps this connection and goodness the goodness of you your true heart your true intentions your mutual love your mutual respect for this person they just they just see also i'm picking up the an angels i'm picking up some angel angel spirit says angel angel whispers so your ancestors and guys may be trying to send you messages about this connection okay just just stay they're making your person aware also spirits on me like i'm getting a couple downloads they're your ancestors your angels there's an angel whispers something about angel whispers with you and your person that's creating awareness okay spirit i, I don't to me, it sounds crazy. Sometimes when I do my readings, I feel like me as a flesh person. It sounds weird, but when I go back, I'm like, everything was fine. So I jumped back and forth, guys. So that was like a back and forth moment. I kind of feel like I was like stuck really quick. But goodness, goodness and mercy shall all follow you all the days of your life. And you will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Would show husband or wife, such a guy that's true. Energy to energy, if it reads. Whoa, I got stuck channeling, guys. Whoa. And that's the feeling that I had in my head. Attraction. You know what I'm saying? Your, your energetic aura, your loving aura, what you put out into the universe is, is so magnifying that it, it's catching your twin flame soulmate. The good you putting out is coming back to you. Okay, attraction. Your captivating, captivating energy makes you attractive. You wear confidence well. Your person knows that. that you know what I'm saying? You're, the energy I'm getting is the person can't wait to be like, let me call my wife or husband. I got it. Let me talk to them first. They're they're waiting for that. They can't wait to be able to say that, okay? And getting to know each other, okay? Enjoy discovering new commodities, goals, and dreams as you get to learn more about each other. Explore, take a ride in, and explore new senior or each other's thoughts. So I feel like when it comes to this connection, spirit wants you guys to really get to know each other, okay? And so at some point, your person was felt disconnected at this with this connection. So you, this person also, they're saying that they don't want secrets. No secrets in this connection. Nothing will come in this situation if you guys keep secrets, okay? And I was wondering what that what what i dealt with that part was about but you know what i'm saying this person that's why they were taking accountability because they don't want secrets when it comes to connection they want to tell you the truth the whole truth and nothing but the truth they, they they're ready for this okay so spirit let's clarify i'm picking up some spirits call me to pull some more um tarot cards okay spirit I'll pull some more tarot cards. okay spirit can you clarify getting to know each other please birthing new ideas so spirits encourage you guys to get to come know each other getting to know each other yeah i feel like you guys need to arise and get because remember we always grow yes you may have met your person then and they who were they were but that but who they were then may not be who they are now so 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 come in and get to know them better to, to 
to get to know them because we're growing and glowing okay so they're so don't think because you know your person is up or no because they're constantly evolving you're constantly evolving so the message i'm getting right now is we're saying never stop trying to get to know your person they may like crab legs three months ago and they may like spaghetti meatballs now so so never stop exploring who they are never stop because we change so much as people don't get caught up on thinking you know your person. Always explore them and who they are. Always get to know them. Always ask them how they are. Just be who you, be who you want your person to be with you. That's what Spirit's saying. Be who you want your person to be with you. So you want your person to be uh, intuitive too? So I'm just kidding. So your person is very intuitively guided to this connection. Explore. And I feel like you bought out the um, intuitive side of your person that you may not know that they're really aware of how intuitive that they really are because we don't know and i was picking that up too but i was like is this really what's going on we don't know when i got insight and godliness and awareness we don't know how much gifts your person has this is at the bottom of the deck you create a lot of balance you came in and this is this harmony whenever your person was feeling see you 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 you're speaking your truth to the person help them Whatever disharmony it was in, thank you, Spirit, for clarifying disharmony. Whatever disconnection your person was in prior to meeting you, you helped them connect back. But like I said, your person, you don't know what type of gifts they have. That's why That's why another reason, too, you got to live in integrity. What if your person's really intuitive and they don't tell you that and, and they can see and watch everything that you do and they know? You know what I'm saying? So, like, I feel like your person meeting you made them aware of 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 a king or a queen that they are meeting you elevated them meeting you brought out their their mysticism their intuitive side and they're very well connected with you through the moon i'll be damned spirit such a goddess crew energy is energy if it resonates it resonates connected to you through the moon i i knew it was something with the talking to you i need to play that song and do a video for that I need to play a song to do a bit of that. Okay, Spirit, can you clarify mystic and birth, please? Embrace the love, this new connection that you're embracing. <laughs> this incense killing me this morning. Not literally, but embrace. See how it's magnifying the love, magnifying the gifts, magnifying the new ideas. Your person loves when you guys, you guys, I'm telling you guys, going to be so in love. You're not, you're not even going to believe it. And, and there, there are some lights around you. So whenever you guys see lights and stuff around you, that's from um your spirit guides and the ancestors because it's going to be a celebration. I hear Nipsey Hustle a celebration. Also now Nipsey Hustle. I'm so mad that I erased that channel message that I had from Pop Smoke. I, I'm. I wish, you know, that was just for me to me and Pop Smoke because the next couple of days an article came out and exactly what i said in that reading came out in the article and how would i have known i wish i would i think i would have like became super i think i would have went super famous with that you know what i'm saying it's always another time you know what i'm saying such a guy's crew energy to energy if it resonates it resonates okay so somebody must have been worried about being left out in the cold or or at some point left you out in the cold again this energy wants to address and it fell it over here again this energy wants to take accountability for the things that happened in the past. So check out a screw this person. They learn. They learn their lesson. They won't do that again. So we're saying they won't do that again. They won't do that again. Yes, and they learn their lesson. Such a goddess crew. Energy to energy, if it resonates. I love guys. And your person's really going in. They're 22, 55 o'clock. They're nervous. Yeah, they're nervous. They're, they're, they're making big moves in their life. So, so give them some time. And you know what I'm saying? Just give me some confirmation. I need some confirmation down below at some point. So I love this. Keep your head up in your heart close, God. I'll catch you guys on my midday mix room next week. Super long Tuesday reading taco to, to taco or tequila baby. And I'll catch you guys on my midday mix room next week. Whatever comes first. Mwah.